It's always summer, when the sun always shined brightly, the breezes were always calm and mild, and life for the animals was peaceful and worry-free. And of all the animals, none was more handsome, and none had a voice more beautiful than Crow. Ah, frog's gonna leap, gator's gonna bite, a gray wolf pack is gonna rule the night. A mountain lion's never been afraid of heights, but it's better when you can fly. Whoa! Hey, that sounds like crow. He's rehearsing. I think he landed. I think he landed. Oh, yo, yo! That guy has got a voice. It looks so good when you're up high. The blues come around, they won't get me down. I can make my escape. I'm not sly like a fox. Don't sting oh. like a bee. A grizzly would never run away. Wow, I Oh, conk! Somebody out there, who's there? Whoops, looks like you're busted! I can't let him smell me like this. Run, fly, flutter, <laughs> go, <laughs> just go! <laughs> then, one day, winter came to the forest for the very first time. And the lives of the animals would never be the same. My toes. <gasps> yes, yes. Ay, que frío. Um, hey, yeah. We gotta do something. There is a solution. Before we freeze to death, everyone. Yeah, we gotta do something before we freeze to death. There is a solution. Someone must fly past the moon and the sun to where the stars dwell, to the one who creates everything by thinking, and convince him or her to unthink the cold and make it warm for us once again. What about Crow? I mean, who could say no to that amazing voice and those beautiful feathers? And his... why don't you just ask him? Crow? Crow's here? Hey, everybody. <laughs> Look, I can't go on a trip right now. I have rehearsals coming up for my show at the pond. You're playing the pond? I think you dig it. You gonna check it out, right? Yeah, maybe. Oh, I gotta see about my schedule and stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. If you're free, come on by. I guess that leaves me. Mutts can fly. Yeah. But you just fly right into the sun. <laughs> I would, wouldn't I? <laughs> well, not to toot my own horn, but owls are known for their expertise on the wing, even in absolute darkness. Wish me luck. Oh dear, my vertigo. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Well, I guess that leaves you, Crow. Come on, guys. There's plenty of birds that can run your errand. I I've got a show to do. Look, there is not gonna be a show at the pond if we're all frozen solid. Give me a break. I'm an artist, not a messenger boy. I've got rehearsals. I've got my fans to think about. So that's all we are to you, fans. Uh, well. And I thought you were. I thought you were more than just a voice with feathers. Well. But I guess I was wrong. Look, it's not like I'm saying it would be hard. So you'll do it? <gasps> so 
the crow begin his journey to find the one who creates everything by thinking. Break a leg, crow. Thanks, Luna. This ain't as easy as I thought. But don't really break a leg. Crow, hey, listen, space is no place for a bird. You need to get back down to Earth. <laughs> hey, watch the feathers! Sorry. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Hey, that's not down. You go the wrong way, Crow. Wrong way! the place. A couple more flats, Crow. Ooh, bird. I wish Crow was back. Well, I thought he'd be back already. Who knows? Maybe he found someplace warm and we'll never see him again. No. I know he'll do whatever he can. Make any sacrifice to save us. Unless something happened. What if he's in trouble? I will go find out! No, Moth! You won't be able to resist the sun's warm, soothing glow. I can handle the sun! No! Ah! You look at this place. Crow had found the palace of the one who creates everything by thinking, the source of the entire universe. 